Welcome to DX Sudoku training video number 45. In this video, we will discuss the advanced puzzle solving technique called Unique Rectangle Type 1. All the uniqueness puzzle solving techniques are based on the one solution rule. The one solution rule means for a Sudoku to be considered valid, it must only have one solution. Consider the following Sudoku in progress. When looking for a unique rectangle type 1, the first thing we do is highlight all the cells having two possible candidates. Next, we are looking for a rectangular pattern where three corners of the rectangle all have the same two possible candidates. We search each cell having two possible candidates looking for our rectangular pattern. We find what we are looking for, a rectangular pattern where three corners of the rectangle all have the same two possible candidates as shown. Next, we confirm the fourth cell shares the same two possible candidates with the other three cells. We have found a fourth cell completing the rectangular pattern as required. Before we choose the possible two candidate as the value of cell 4, 7, let's confirm the unique rectangle type 1 logic. Let's assume cell 4, 7 is not 2. Then we have the following ambiguous puzzle where we have to guess how to proceed. We have two scenarios to consider. The first scenario is we choose 4 as the value of cell 4, 7, and it results in a set of numbers solving the puzzle. Then, if choosing 4 resulted in solving the puzzle, we must assume choosing 5 would also result in a different set of numbers solving the puzzle. The second scenario is we choose 4 as the value of cell 4, 7, and it does not result in a valid solution to the puzzle. This is exactly what happens. When we do choose the value 4, we end up with an invalid solution as shown. The same thing happens when we choose 5 as the value of cell 4, 7. We end up with an invalid solution as shown. In the first scenario, we have two solutions which violates our unique solution rule. And in the second scenario, we have two invalid solutions. So we must conclude the value of cell 4, 7 must be 2. We choose the value 2 for cell 4, 7 as shown. Before we begin testing, let's consider one more special case example. We highlight all the cells having two possible candidates. We search each cell having two possible candidates looking for a rectangular pattern of three cells all having the same two possible candidates. We find the three cells. Next we confirm the fourth cell shares the same two possible candidates as the other three cells. We have confirmed the fourth cell does share the same two possible candidates as the other three cells. We therefore do have a valid unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the current puzzle. Except this time we have two additional possible candidates in our fourth cell. The logic for why we must remove 6 and 7 as possible candidates from the 4th cell remains the same. We remove 6 and 7 from the 4th cell because we must conclude the 4th cell is either a possible 2 or possible 8 value. Notice how in this case, after we remove the 6 and 7, it opens up a hidden single with the possible 6 candidate in block 6. Time to test what you have learned. Before we begin, please remember to take some time to support the Sudoku. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Make sure you identify the fourth cell and possible candidates to be removed. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. 
pause the video and find the unique rectangle type 1 pattern in the puzzle. Here is the solution. This completes DXadoku training video number 45. Please support DXadoku. Thank you for watching.